New at noon, we now know the identity of the man shot and killed by a Cincinnati police officer. Family members confirmed 22-year-old Quandavier Hicks died from a single gunshot wound inside a Chase Avenue home. His family calls him Q, by the way. A 9 on your side reporter, Allie Kramer, is live from the scene with what we know about the victim and this investigation. Allie. Good afternoon, Tanya. Well, emotions are certainly running high here on the scene of that officer involved shooting this red home behind me where you see these people gathered. This is the home where Hicks lived in and also the home where he was shot to death by that Cincinnati police officer. Now, just moments ago, take a look at some of this video. One of his friends took us inside the home and up the stairs showing us just where Hicks was shot by that Cincinnati police officer. The blood still on the stairs. Family claiming that Hicks was shot in the back of the head. Now, police say the incident, it all began as an aggravating menacing call. They tracked Hicks to this home. Now, once inside, police say Hicks pulled out a rifle, and that's when one officer fired just that single shot. Now, Hicks' grandmother, she is here. She is filled with both anguish and anger right now. And I'm going to be with you, tell me, Grandma. I love you. I will never hear the words again. I would never get to my grandson away for no reason. They watched him go in the house. They could have grabbed him while he was outside on the corner. Why would they wait till they till he get in the house? Now you saw some of those emotions right in there, right there, some very deep sadness, and then that anger, the frustration. Of course, the family members and friends, they still have many questions about what led up to the shooting, as do we, and we will be asking those tough questions to police today. They're having a press conference this afternoon, we're told, with Chief Blackwell. At 2 o'clock, we will be there to ask those questions. We'll also be streaming it live right here on 9 on Your Side. Reporting live in Northside, Allie Kramer, 9 on Your Side. Thanks, Allie.